Hey guys, <clears throat> excuse me, it's Barely Honest, and today we've got the main version of Sephora Play, or Play by Sephora, I don't know why I always mix that up. Uh, <clears throat> thank you guys so much for all the love on the channel, all the likes, all the comments, all the shares, and most importantly, the subscriptions. You guys can check us out on BarelyHonest.com, you can find links to our Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter feeds, as well as our Contact Us page, which has our PO box, and our BarelyHonest.gmail.com email address. Sephora Play <clears throat> is a $10 a month beautification box via Sephora the store, which you always get your extra 50 play points. I heard this month you can use it online. You can. This month only. Ooh. Why well, forget to use? There's two sitting there because I don't go to Sephora every month. You can't use it online, so now I can use it online. Okay. Oh, it's not the Wendy's bag. That one kind of looks nice. Oh, yeah, it's got a shoelace. It's like a rope. No, it's a shoelace. Oh. <laughs> what does it say on the front? Say anything? Play. That's a four. Oh. It's a better quality bag than the other ones. Ooh. Oh my god, throw it at me. So you can feel it. Oh, kind of dead on me. Interesting. Play your little match game. There you go. Alright. So the first thing is Turt? Yes. Turtist? Tartiest? I don't know how to say that. I think it's Tartist. It's like a, a line of theirs. They have all lipsticks and all sorts of stuff. Lash Paint Mask... I can't even freaking talk tonight. Lash Paint Mascara. A perfect go-to mascara that lifts, sculpts, and lengthens lashes. Ooh. Let's get some suction on that. That's a serious brush right there. You guys can see that. Definitely gets you some goop on there, though. That's good. You want it to get the goop. The goop. But you don't want, what do they call it, spider lashes or whatever they are, where it's all goopy? Yeah, you don't want that. That's not a good look. Fuzzy lashes? Mm. It's not too bad. I've never tried that one, so it's good. This is Hourglass. A Veil Mineral Primer. It's kind of a cool bottle. Is it actual glass? Yeah. See? I thought primer you put on your face. You do. It's not a brush, it's like a spatula, isn't it? Yeah, it's like a lip spatula. It's just to get it out. Put it on your hand and see what it feels like. Not on your on the back of your hand. <laughs> You're pinky. <laughs> what are you weird? I don't like it. Does that have a smell? No. Makes me feel silky smooth and I don't like it. Kind of the point. <clears throat> no. So it does what it's supposed to. Yeah. Uh, it was a silky, oil-free primer that reduces the look of redness, pores, and lines. It was silky. Yeah. <laughs> you don't like it. I don't like it. It's by Bob. No. Pab. No. That's what it says. P A B. Or Pob. No. B B. Bumble and Bumble. There you go. Unrivaled volume. Bumble and Bumble thickening volume hairspray. Setting spray that extends the style lifts at the roots and adds major volume. Let's see if it smells. That's got alcohol in it. It's hairspray. Woo wee! That just burned my nose hairs out, man. Let me smell it. 
There's good smelling hairspray and there's bad. Mm. I don't know. It smells like pretty a pretty alcoholic. Yeah. Uh Kat Von D. Budge proof brilliance. Tattoo liner and trooper. And trooper? A waterproof liquid eyeliner with a super fine brush tip that goes on smooth. So this is supposed to be like the best liquid eyeliner. I've never tried it. The best ever? The best that, yeah, well like the best that stays on your eyes and doesn't smear. Kat Von you don't mess around. I can't get into this crap. Here, let me get it. There you go. Oh, that's why. Okay. Ooh, that's a super fine tip. You guys see that? Don't stretch. Don't what? Stretch. Yeah, that's pretty fine. I could do some calligraphy with that, man. <laughs> what are you writing? I don't know. I was just swirling around. Oh. It's supposed to be really good. See? You see the swirls in the middle there? Like, I'm excited to try it. <clears throat> uh, definition of detox, Sephora collection, mud mask, purifying and mattifying. A detoxifying mud mask that clarifies skin with zinc and copper. Yeah, that's a mud mask. That's, got, that's pungent. It's what? It's pungent. So, that I've actually tried. It's alright. It's pungent. There's a time you could get that with your points. Like, you could use your points on it. But you got it in your thing. I know, now I got it. Another one. Which I just used up the one I had. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's a... You know, when I took a bath and I had this something all over my face, that's what this was. Mm -hmm. So this is by Chloe. Flawless Florals, a warm floral blend of oak moss and freesia create. Oh, freesia create a sweet, romantic, and refreshing scent. So let's spray the thingy. This one could be strong. That's not bad. Not too floral. It's, it's well, it's a little floral, but it's not too bad at all. Grab it by the end. It's kind of manly. No, Musty. I was gonna say it was kind of chicky, but is there a mo oak moss? I think mm -hmm. that's what I'm smelling. It's not bad. I'll try it out. That might be one of the first ones I actually like. Will wear. Yeah. Not bad. Hmm. So, what do you think for this month? As you rub on yourself, it won't come off, and I licked my finger and tried to rub it off. Okay. So that must be good, right? Yeah. Um, I like this box. Okay. It was worth the ten dollars. Yeah, because. I mean, they're small. I think you've got a lot of good stuff for 10 bucks. Because I think this by itself is like 5 You could probably get like 3 or 4 uses out of the mask. That's what I got with the last one. The hairspray, it's nice to have a little hairspray. I'm excited to try the eyeliner. Hourglass is a good brand. And I like Tarte stuff. Plus and I'll the try the perfume. I can tell you it definitely beats First Box and Ipsy this last month. Yeah, they got, they got their proverbial shit together this month. Yeah, this one was much better. So I like it. It was A and I can spend my points online. Mm -hmm. Not that I need anything from Sephora right now, but maybe I do. I don't know. What do you guys think of this month's box? Let us know in the comments down below. If you like this video, guys, hit that thumbs up button. 
Feel free to share this video as you see fit. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. And until then, have a nice day.